Hello there my friends, welcome to part 7 of my Returning to Bloodborne series. Hope you guys are doing well. Last episode, we took on Vicar Amelia. <laughs> it's really good to see her after two years of not playing this game. Uh, we also took care of all the remaining unopened gates in Cathedral Ward. Uh, or rather the outskirts of Cathedral Ward and Grand Cathedral. Uh, what else do we do? Oh yeah, and we also recruited... Um, two new NPCs to live with us <laughs> and um, one of them's not very friendly and I'd rather you know have sent him over to Yusefka's clinic because that guy's a right douchebag but it's okay for the purposes of this playthrough we're gonna have a full house <laughs> anyway guys what we're gonna do now um, what's happened is the world has changed uh, meaning you know things are gonna be a bit different when we get back to um, to the world and sorry just randomly you know all these square pillar things were they always there <laughs> I've never really thought about it but anyway okay so like I said everything has kind of changed um, so we are now progressing the game forward let's grab this this is probably going to be for the DLC it is excellent right the eye of a blood drunk hunter beckons hunters to the hunter's nightmare a deformed creature will whisk you away outside Odin Chapel. Alright, let's have a look at that. Okay, what would that be? <laughs> Here we go. Alright, check it out. There's a couple of more things I've got to read out to you as well. Okay, Eye of the Blood Drunk Hunter. The Eye of Blood Drunk Hunter, its pupil is collapsed and turned to mush. Oh, bloody hell. Indicating the onset of the scourge of beasts. A hunter who goes drunk with blood is said to be taken by the nightmare, destined to wander forever, engaged in an endless hunt. It is a fate that no hunter can, uh, can escape. Really interesting. Okay, also, I got something from Vicar Amelia, and I totally forgot to read this. A uh, gold pendant, a pendant of Vicar Amelia, used to change into a blood gem which fortifies weapons. This pendant, passed down among the vicars who head the healing church, is a reminder of the cautionary adage. To reveal the adage, touch the altar skull. So that's what we did, and we got that great cutscene <laughs> with a very iconic line, fear the old blood. All right, so let's use it. Gold's blood gem. Let's see if it's, if it's really good. I don't remember, guys. It's been two years. I can't remember if it's good or not. All right, here we go. Okay, so that's a blood gem. Attack versus beasts, up by 12.6%. Uh, right, let me think. Um, okay, guys, what we're gonna do today, I'm oh, sorry, I forgot to mention, we've got a, a, a level two sort out before we kind of go any further. It's super scary, and guys, I have not done it in two years. I don't remember my strategy for it. Um, there's going to be a very dangerous boss, and I don't know if I'm ready for him, but I will sincerely give it a try. Okay, so this will... Uh, oh, I know why I can use... Guys, I know why I can use this against. In fact, it's going to be that very boss I was talking about. Okay, give me a moment. Okay, we're going to fortify weapons, etc. But, guys, I need to buy something. All right, I hope it's available, please. I hope it is. Okay, you remember in last episode, Henrik, it was a hunter that we had a fight with it was part of eileen eileen the crow's quest so this is it now this armor set is excellent against bolts wielding enemies so if they use um you know bolts this is really good protection so i'm going to buy this we're going to get the whole set and i'll read out any law or whatever and guys i leave everything in timestamps if you are not interested in law you can skip ahead and by the way i will need this as well the ashen hunter garb this is good against frenzy which will be <laughs> something we need uh, protection against a bit later in the game all right so i might need to buy some more fire paper but before that right let's have a look okay Right, the hunter's attire worn by Henrik, the old hunter. The tacky turn old hunter Henrik was once partners with Father Gascoigne, and though they were a fierce and gallant duo, their partnership led to Henrik's tragically long life. Henrik's 
unique yellow garb is resistant to bolt and will be of great help to any hunter who has inherited the onus of the hunt. And now, does it say anything new for his hat? <laughs> you never know. Oh, no, don't take it off. Oh, crap. Let's put that back. Okay. Right, anything new? You need uh, resist to bolt. Yeah, it's the same thing. It's fine. That's okay. So we're going to need this for later. Not quite yet, but later. Um, I may as well remove that. Don't need that. Beast blood. I don't know. Okay, guys, just give me a minute. I'm going to... Um, See if I can fortify my weapon. I think I'd like to use Sork. Ah, oh, crap, I can't. I need more twin bloodstone shards, but that's why I'm going to this new place. But let's repair at least. Um, What about my swords? No, nothing. Uh, What about my gun, actually? Let me try my gun, guys. Give me a moment. And I may need flame sp uh, spray as well. Okay, yeah, let's fortify that. I may as well. Okay, good. All right, guys, what I'm going to do then. <laughs> okay, I just need to get myself killed. <laughs> All right, so let me just level up real quick. I need to meet an enemy and just die to him. <laughs> Very well, Clinton. All right, let's just quickly do a level up. I want... I think we'll do one fight and... Ah, shit, I can't do any more than that. Okay, we'll just do that then. I should have done endurance as well. Um, not to worry. And also... Actually, no, what am I doing? Give me a sec, guys. All right, let's use that. How much does this give us? Oh, that should be enough. Right, let's do that. Welcome. What is it? I desire, please, some... Um... Let me stand close. Dude, can you stand up? <laughs> Get up, you idiot. My goodness. Okay, let's do that. And there we go. Done. Okay, so I'm going to meet you at Cathedral Ward and I'll show you what we do next. Hey, guys, we are back. Okay, um... I think I teleported to the wrong place. <laughs> however, however, there is something I wanted to show you guys anyway. Right, check this out. For those of you who've been, who's new to Bloodborne, I've, you've been following this playthrough, and you just thought it was about werewolves and stuff. Now, what the heck is that? <laughs> All right, so that is creepy beyond belief. Look at these statues. Hmm. Anyway, I won't say any more than that. Okay, so we're just going to run back then, I guess. Hello, mate. <laughs> See ya. Okay. Right, check it out. All of these church giants are now sort of bowing and fealty. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't actually understand what the reasoning behind that is. This is the wrong way. Shit. No, it's this way. Oh, no, it's not this way. Crap. One sec. No, don't hit me, please. <laughs> All right, let's go this way. All right, guys. Okay, so there should be a dude um, hiding away in the corner. So I'm going to purposely die to him. He's going to kidnap me and send me somewhere. The hell are you doing, you dick? Ow. <laughs> All right, I want to get at least a couple of hits in. At least. Okay, this should piss him off. Oh, I, I don't want to kill him. <laughs> I was so tempted. I need to get used to this move set anyway. Yes, I know. I look, I'm lame. I want to let him kill me, but still. Okay, hand. He does. He does a dragon punch, and he is nasty, guys. A kick. And, oh, we got me. <laughs> Shit. Oh, you bastard. He joined in as well.
<laughs> all right welcome to yargul unseen village guys this place is scary af if you've uh, never played this and you get kidnapped by one of those dudes he basically just puts you in a sack <laughs> and he brings you here and um it this is one of the most frightening most disturbing places you'll be visiting in bloodborne so we're in jail we need to get the hell out of here now guys please forgive me my memory is a little bit foggy regarding this remember i've not played this game in two years i'm coming back to this game because it is bloody awesome but i don't remember everything all right let's grab this oh wait my my lamp's off <laughs> that's better okay so what's this madmen toil surreptitious, uh, surreptitiously in rituals to beckon the moon uncover their secrets so these are clues to what's to kind of come later on all right guys so let's keep heading down <laughs> all right so you heard that guys that's another npc i'm going to show you something as well you can actually um recruit her but she won't trust me yet because i'm wearing wait uh, i'll i'll just uh, go up to her. right check this out so she's hidden away here look at her outfit we picked something up like this earlier on oh please leave me be don't take me, please. Oh, please, dear gods. Calm down, lady. Okay, so what we need to do is we've got to switch to this one here, black church hat. Um, I think you have to wear the entire thing or maybe just one. But for sake of um, showing this, I'll put everything on. Where's the other one? Surgical gloves, okay. Uh, black church trousers. So check it out. I'm now one of her basically so we'll speak to her and she'll trust us oh, by your god the healing church you've got to save me oh thank you dear saint i have no words to express my relief you can take this at least madman's knowledge yes lady i did a superman change <laughs> sure to please an upstanding member of the church like you oh thank you so much dear gods okay so let's keep speaking to her let, let me get rid of that so we can see her face properly okay thank you so much i was seized on the street by a hulking brute in the cathedral ward and locked up here there were many others but they've been taken away and I've heard moans echoing in the distance ever since. All right, so keep talking to her. So, the hunt is on tonight. Then the streets are perilous and every door will be shut tight. Perhaps it isn't my place to ask, but do you know somewhere that might take me in? In fact, I do. It's called Odin Chapel. So you can tell her of that if you want to be a bastard. Yeah, you can send her to your Safka's clinic. <laughs> but anyway, we'll send her to Odin Chapel. Oh, thank you so much. I'll set out as soon as I can. I pray for success on your hunt. Kind hunter. All right. Anything else? I'll set it up. I can't no same thing all right guys so that's mission accomplished so we got our uh, well to my knowledge the final npc to send over to home or uh odin chapel uh guys sorry as i'm as i'm talking i'm thinking as well because i had a specific way of doing this i i think i know what to do but give me a minute give me a minute let me change no no let me just carry on let me just get a <laughs> get my bearings because at the moment i'm confused af i remember the downstairs npc in fact for this level i guess we can use ludwig's sword all right anyway so when you first come in you hear all this um 
all this music, you just feel... Oh, wait, wait, I do know what's here. Hang on one sec. One second. There should be a thingy. One second, guys. Oh, it's not here. Really? Okay, don't go down there yet. No, come back, you bastard. Okay, good. Good. All right, can you hear that? There's actually a enemy there. Um, normally, I would go down there, but something's telling me don't go there yet, and I don't remember why. <laughs> It's just uh, subconscious. I'm just remembering from my uh, previous playthroughs why I did or why I used to do. Right, these dudes, I'll show you. It's basically the guys who kidnapped us. They are super weak to um, poison. So if you're not confident in fighting them... Give me a sec. Okay, how many is there? There should be about three. Two or three. All right, before any of that, guys... Check it out. There's your um, lamp. Okay, guys, check this out. Look at what's there. What are they worshipping? And finally, guys, I've never been able to uh, figure this out. Any Bloodborne lore masters out there, please can you help me? There's a child here with that cage on. Does anybody know what that is? Or who that's supposed to be? Anyway, so I'll leave that for you guys to <laughs> help me decipher all right so you see these pricks oh shit i don't know what alert the other one okay so they're gonna come running or maybe not look at that damage whoa okay so wait until he comes here okay so two poison knives should kill him but hey one poison knife Oh, look, see, the other guy's gone berserk. When you take him to a certain, um, I don't know, a third of their health, they go into, like, a frenzied state. They get more aggressive. They get really pissed off. Oh, they're leaving, guys. See, look at that. Half health. Guys. I don't know. This is risky. Okay. All right. <laughs> Run back down. <laughs> Sorry, I'm being a coward, but <laughs> look at him. He's just—he's just stuck. Look at that fucker. Haha, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Dickhead. Yeah, guys, this just makes your life a whole lot easier when dealing with them now obviously we can't cheese all of them i have to fight them all eventually now um give me a sec how do we open this there should be yeah right there should be a door here okay right and finally no this door opens much later so we're not ready yet what are you doing dude <laughs> okay all right let's move on um there should be an old lady there as well twin bloods check it out look at this this is awesome all right where are you okay moon rune acquire acquire more blood echoes a secret symbol left by carol rune smear of bergenworth a transcription of moon as spoken by the great ones inhabiting the nightmare gain more blood echoes the great ones that inhabit the nightmare are sympathetic in spirit and often answer when called upon really really good you can actually do this when farming or use it when farming right there's that stupid cow oh crap i should have went behind her damn it <laughs> die you bitch okay now let me just remember guys um or try to remember if i go outside this way oh damn it there's gonna be a pig I just remember two pigs. Damn. Okay, anyway. <sighs> There's going to be a pig here. We just got to wait for a bit. I hope he doesn't see me. To my right, where I'm looking, there's going to be another one of those um, sack men. But he's going to have two dogs with us. Look, guys, I don't know if he's going to see me. 
And as you know, they hit very hard. So, ah, shit. I don't know if I can catch up to him. Dude, why do you take so long, you stupid fucker? Oh, no. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. Okay, I better concentrate. Okay, good. Here we go. Here we go. Got you. Right. There's going to be quite a few dogs here as well, but I don't want to trigger them yet. Right, there's dogs below. Might be a snatcher up ahead as well, but let's... Guys, let's take care of this dude here. Listen to that music. All right, guys, check it out. Okay, so we got two dogs and the dude as well. This is going to be a little bit tricky. We should be all right, though. Okay, I want to antagonize the dogs. Shit. No, what are you doing? Oh, my God, my hunter's a dick. One second. <laughs> Sorry, guys. One second. Okay, good. Where's the other one? Okay, now for you. No, don't spin the camera, please. Okay, same thing again. Poison this bitch. I want to bring him out here because there's more space to fight him. That's fine. Let him do that. That's fine. Oh, damn it, man. Okay, wait. No, don't jump, you dick. Oh my god, I don't know why my hunter did that. <laughs> he died anyway. Yeah, guys, I was standing still, right? And my hunter still did a leaping attack. Oh, anyway, I'll stop moaning. Whatever. <laughs> All right. I need to try and remember if there's any collectibles here. I don't think there is. Guys, when I first played this, I was shitting my pants when, when I got to this area. I was confused. I was all alone. <laughs> and I thought I'd done something wrong in order to be, you know, kidnapped. Anyway, more twin shards, which is great. Okay, guys, this will open... The bot. Oh, how do I explain? I haven't even been there yet. So let's open it. Okay, roll back. <laughs> roll back quickly. Right, kill these ladies. Careful. Oh, you bastard. Okay. All right, check it out. Okay, kill these lot. Just bear in mind to your left in another room, there's going to be those um, snatcher dudes. So. All right, he's seen me, hasn't he? Or has he not? Okay, just just wait. Let's just collect our bots here first. Let's clear this area. Are you dead? Yeah, I think he is. Okay, so there's two of those dudes there. All right, kill these dudes here. Okay, there we go. Oh shit, you see me already, damn it. He knows, or rather he knows I'm here. Where is he? Dude, I'm here, moron. I wonder. Guys, I wonder. <laughs> okay. Okay, you know what? Right, we're gonna run here. So, again, we can cheese these two. Guys, I have no idea what the hell that does. <laughs> I think it saps a little bit of your stamina. Right, he may jump, so I've got to be careful. Come on, you bitch. Hurry up. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, what I was trying to say was, you can wait here. You can just wait here and just cheese him through here. So, now he's in berserk mode, I think. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. <laughs> so you can just wait here. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> Let's do it from here, guys. <laughs> Damn it. Right, there we go. He's going to be dead soon. Right, there we go. That's one. 
Oh, uh, by the way, you can farm this area if you need to. You get a ton of echoes. All right, there's his body. I think we can just um. Guys, give me a sec. Let me let me. No, no. We better go the other side. No, we should be all right. Okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. I will poison him, but not now. Okay, going this way will lead to the boss. All right, there we go. Uh, uh oh, did I not poison? Oh, shit. All right, whatever. Okay. Come on out, you come. Uh, where are you? <laughs> Dude. Okay. All right, let's throw this. I just wasted a knife as well. Oh, crap. Whoa there, buddy. Okay, <laughs> he's on his way, guys. The poison will take care of him, so we can just chill here. So anyway, um, again, this boss that's up there, I'm really scared of him. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. I think there's a way to kill him. Um, if I can... Wait one sec, guys. Okay, good. He's dead. So if this helps anybody out there, if you're stuck and thinking it's almost impossible to leave this place... Um, hope this helps. Okay, nothing else here. All right, guys, so let's keep going. Okay, there is a pig here. Gotta be kind of wary. Um, also some dogs. Another one of those snatcher dudes. Or the bag men, whatever you want to call them. Okay, there's something up here, but I don't remember. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, I just remembered. Okay, there's one of those um, wandering nightmare dudes here. Can you stop running, please? <laughs> okay. All right, there we go. Grab that. More twin shards. And this is to open that door that I was telling you about earlier. By the way, guys, this place turns into something even more nightmarish later much later in the game so uh, we're kind of setting up this place all right i need to think need to think how do i how do i used to do this okay read this a bit law behold a pale blood sky not quite yet but yeah <laughs> it'll, it'll get to that but not not yet all right hold on guys Okay, I need to try and remember what's here. I think it's just dogs, to be fair. But anyway, we'll grab that in a second. Let's just clear this area. Don't leap forward, please. Okay, good. Two hits. Oh, we can just, just rush him. It's fine. Okay, good. Right, we can't open this now. It'll be a bit later as well. Mailman's knowledge. Madman's knowledge. Uh, what else? So they are looking this way. Bowing. They're all church hunters, guys. Sorry, uh, I've just been a bit distracted. They're all church hunters, and they're looking towards this. Hmm. I've got a theory as to why, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, check this out. Right. Black hooded iron helm. Yaragul black guard, basically. Let's grab all of that. Oh, while my hunter's having a sit down, <laughs> let's have a look at this. No, I don't want to do that. Sorry, my bad. Okay. Where are you? Oh, crap. One sec. If I come out of this. Guys, that music is horrifying, but awesome at the same time. Right, Yaragul Black Garb. Thick black pullover worn by hunters of the unseen village. The hunters of Yaragul answer to the village's founders, the, the School of Mensis. Hunters in name only, these kidnappers blend into the night wearing this attire. Designed primarily to defend from physical attacks, the binding of thick rope serves both to protect its wearer and restrain his foes. Let's wear it. <laughs> Let's give it a try. 
Okay, remove. Hey, is it because I'm sitting down? Oh, uh, what? It's not letting me take this off. Oh, you know what? Whatever. Never mind. Okay. Just checking around here. And even these statues, my goodness. <laughs> so awesome, guys. And final check up here. Okay, check it out. Right, Frenzy Cold Blood. So now we're going to tackle the other side. That's going to be slightly more dangerous, in my opinion. Um, nothing here. Okay. Wait. Oh, what's this? All right. Okay, guys, it's going to be a piggy down there. I'm just trying to remember, was there a way to do this so I can stay as safe as possible? I've been here already. <laughs> All right. Anyway, let's go in here real quick. Now, can we activate this from here? No. Oh, Hunter, can you... Dude, can you stop it, man? My goodness. All right, anything behind here? No, there isn't. Well, he knows I'm here. Goodness gracious. Okay, one second. One second. Just having a look. Okay, down below is obviously going to be dogs. So what I'm going to do is... I'm going to have to lure out the pig. He could one hit kill me. <laughs> so I need to be careful. Hey, piggy. Oh, crap. Okay, here we go, guys. Okay. Oh, shit. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. Good. 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 All right, guys. Now. So that's mission one accomplished. Mission two is to wipe out the dogs. I'm constantly hitting R3 to lock onto any. There should be one there. I can see it. All right, wait, wait. Come on, come on. Yes, come on, you stupid bastard. Okay, good. Rally health. Okay. Oh, shit. There's one there. Okay, he hasn't seen me yet. There's another one that's sacked. Oh, shit, there's one here. Damn. Sorry, guys. The <laughs> reason I'm hesitating, I don't want to fight all of them at the same time, you know? Okay. Okay. Sorry, I'm going quiet. I'm just... <laughs> I don't want to die. I'm just trying to concentrate. Okay. Who's next? Oh, crap. I knew it. I knew it. That's why I'm so careful, guys. So I tried to be... Can you stop? Oh, my God. Goodness. All right, whatever. Okay, so he should be the last one now in this area. Nope. There's another one. <laughs> God, are you serious? Wow. Piss off, man. I, I don't believe this. I do not believe this. Oh, can you dodge, please? Oh. <laughs> God damn it, guys. Oh, anyway, whatever. Is that it now, please? I don't want to fight like 50 million more dogs. It's kind of getting boring now. Could use a pebble, I suppose. No, I know what to do. Here's the cheese, another one. So, obviously, poison this bitch. He's gonna know I'm here, but we can just run away. Okay, what I think happens is he stops following after a while. Yeah, he stops. Okay, so he should turn back round and we can get a backstab on him. Hopefully, to finish him off. 
Is he facing me? I can't tell. Oh my goodness. Okay, one sec. <laughs> Still, no, no, he's facing away. Guys, he's facing away. It's okay. Let's get rid of that. Okay. All right, Hunter. For the love of God, please don't jump forwards. Please don't. Good. Oh, God! <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, good, 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 good. Excellent. Right, check it out. Do you remember the last episode, guys? I was getting my ass kicked by a dude with some electric weapon. Well, this is it. All right, don't want to remove it. Just want to go in here. Right, check it out. We need high arcane to use this, and it is a blunt weapon. It's pretty good. Um, I like it. I don't love it, but I do like it. It is pretty cool. Um, you can use it against certain enemies, but anyway, well, let's read up on it. Tenitrus, a unique trick weapon contrived by Archibald, the infamous eccentric of the Healing Church Workshop. Striking this peculiar iron, morning star flail-like, um, a match generates the same blue sparks that blanket a dark beast. That's a clue for what we're going to fight soon. Unfortunately, for reasons untold, the hunters of Archibald's time did not fully take to the device. And it is pretty good. Um, I do use it for farming. I'll show you that much later when we get to that level. All right. Uh, is that it? I swear there was something else here. Or am I misremembering? No, I think that's it, guys. I think. <laughs> I think. But yes, as I explained before, this place turns into... Oh, a pile of dog shit <laughs> later on. If you think it's bad now, it gets even worse later on. All right, guys, I think we're done, you know. I think we are. Everything's been accounted for. Um, Wait, there is one more place. No, that's a lift, isn't it? Give me a minute. No, there's something here I didn't collect. My bad. Okay. Frenzy cold blood and... Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to obviously level up. I think I can only get two skills. I want to do endurance if I can. And I guess vitality, I suppose. But we'll see. Um, anyway, guys, so what I'll do is I'll meet you over there. And um, we'll have to come back here and go get the boss. So I'll see you in a bit. Hey, guys. We're back. Are you okay? Hey, I need... Sorry, I, I know I love law and everything, but I'm in a rush. <laughs> sorry, lady. Ah, welcome home, good hunter. I must have drifted off. What is it you desire? I desire, please. A little bit more stamina. Okay. Or should I do that? <laughs> I don't know, guys. You know what? Screw it. Let's do one more for... Uh, I don't know. You know what, guys? Whatever. Let's just, let's just get this done. It's fine. Have I got enough echoes to fortify? Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so let's go back in here. Uh, see if German's got any new dialogue. We'll try and find him in just a second. Right, let's fortify. For this, I'd advise you... I mean, use whatever weapon you want, but I would advise you use the saw cleaver. I've got eight left. I could do Ludwig's Holy Blade, but I'm not going to use it for this fight. Oh, and, guys... Give me a sec. Yes, I think we can add one more thing in here. No, we can't. Shit. My bad. I thought we could. We can't. <sighs> Sorry, guys. The reason I'm hesitating 
I'm just thinking, shall I add that one that was 12% against beasts? Or shall I just keep this? So physical attack up 7.3. Guys, I'm gonna risk it. I hope I hope I'm not messing I'm not I'm messing myself up. However, the second one, we could put the 7.3. I'm gonna try this out. It may not work. I hope it does. Now, for this particular uh fight, what you want to do is uh, let me just repair real quick. Oh, that's Ludwig's. Okay. Right, for this particular fight, you want to wear Henrik's uh garb. Because what we're gonna fight is gonna do a shit ton of bolts damage to us so we want to change into this okay here we go so we're now wearing all of henrik's gear and if we go into this here right where is it bolts bolt is 316 negation or however you want to say that but um Gosh, I'm a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm a little nervous, but uh, we'll give it a try. It may take a few attempts, but you want to aim for its um its limbs. You want to break its limbs. So we're gonna do that. Now for this one though, do I want to poison him? Oh, and fire. Use fire paper against him as well. Okay, let's get this all ready. So beast bloods and fire. All right, guys. Look, wish me luck. <laughs> I've not done this in a while. Um, yeah, I'll see you there. Right, check it out, guys. I'll just wait until he walks away. This Henrik um, outfit is awesome. I actually like it. It's pretty cool. Okay, let's think about this. I'm just going to run through. I don't really want to fight anyone. Okay, so they're going to spaz out when they see me. So what we're doing is just heading down here. But be careful because the old ladies are there and they can grab you like that. I could just run through, couldn't I? All right, run back. Oh, you bastard. Wait. <laughs> Guys, they're tricking me. They really are. I'm just going to run. Just run. Okay. Right. Remember these two? Okay. Yep. All right. Whatever. Very nice. Okay. So the boss is actually here. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Okay. Are they still following me? No. Good. Okay. This is it, guys. If you need any help, you've got the... Um, uh, sorry, there's a summon here. You can uh, recruit, but I'm not going to do that. But guys, I'm going to be honest. It's been two years. <laughs> I don't remember 100% how to fight this bitch. But one last thing. The music for this boss is one of my favorite in the entire game. So, all right. Wish me luck. <laughs> wish me luck. All right, here we go. Check it out. Okay, he's going to do that. Okay, cool. guys whoa okay guys he hits hard very wow wow okay wow 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 all right shit okay see this armor set is a godsend okay Okay, stamina. Oh god. Oh god! Oh shit! Oh shit, guys! Okay, one sec. This is this is flopping. Yep, I died. <laughs> Damn it, guys. It's been a while. I have not fought him in a while. I'll see you back here. Hey guys, we are back. Okay, let me just switch this on again. 
Every time you die, this uh, lamp always switches off. Okay, let me get my head together now. Where did this go wrong? Oh, she's waiting. He knows I'm gonna come. Oh, damn it, man. All right. Okay. All right, let's do this. Okay, I need to concentrate a bit now. All right, here we go. One sec, one sec. Oh, we did it, yes. <laughs> yes, we did it. Guys, that was super sloppy. I've not fought this bitch in two years. We ended up getting him. <laughs> so just, yeah, hit his limbs. Um, you know, use a, a beast blood. Even if you don't use beast blood, you can see the principle. He's super weak to fire. And uh, yeah, just keep hitting his limbs. The only thing that will do a shit ton of damage is his physical attacks. And guys, I just couldn't remember. He's got two front swipes. I guess I could have, I could have just stepped back. What I was trying to do was um, move forwards. And I was getting caught. And if you get caught while you're dodging, you lose even more uh, damage. So, yeah. Anyway, whatever. It's done. <laughs> wow. Just made um, 92 echoes there. <laughs> Guys, we did it, man. That's awesome. So, let's switch this on. Now, is there anything around here? I don't think so. Now, I'm going to show you something. Is it here? Where's the door? Ah, crap. One second, guys. Is it this? Right, check this out. We're going to open this door. And also, I need to check the footage when I edit. I just want to see if this um, blood gem actually made a huge difference. Because he's a beast, after all. Right, look where we are. <laughs> so, if you don't know, this is Old Yarnum. Or the streets of Old Yarnum. Right. All right, I want to test. Sorry, guys, I want to test this. Okay, how much damage are we doing? Whoa, who the hell are you? Oh, shit. Okay, well, um, <laughs> I did expect these dudes. Oh, my God, dude, really? I'm not going to die to you, scrubs. Oh, crap. <laughs> okay, one sec. Why did I miss? Why did I hit miss? So we're super strong now, guys, uh, comparatively to where we first started out. Obviously, yes, I fortified the weapon a few times, but we've also put that gem in there. So uh, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to test the damage, really. But this is um, Old Yarnum, uh, where we fought the Bloodstaff Beast, etc. Now, what you would do if you want to keep... Um, I forgot his name, Jura. You know the guy with the Gatling gun? He was shooting raining fire upon you, or bullets upon you. If you want to befriend him, you can't go up and climb that ladder to attack him. You have to avoid all his bullets. When you come through here, you can then climb the ladder, but this time he's not going to attack you, and you can make friends with him. So just letting you know. Anyway, guys, listen, this has been a pleasure. <laughs> it's been a bit scary, and it was exciting for me because I've never been here for two years. I really enjoyed this. Um, if you enjoyed yourself, please like the video, please subscribe, and I'll catch you in part eight. Take care.